Hi, everybody. My name is Quaylen Bobbitt. I am a representative from the Better Business Bureau of Metro Atlanta, Athens, and Northeast Georgia. Today, we have the esteemed privilege of honoring one of our Student of Integrity Scholarship winners, Anna. Anna, why don't you introduce yourself? Hi, I'm Anna. I go to, I'm going to be graduating from North Cobb Christian School, maybe, if Corona doesn't take over. Um, but yeah, I'm super excited and honored to be receiving this scholarship. So yeah. Absolutely. So how did you hear about our scholarship? Um, so I actually saw it on a scholarship website when I was just researching ways to kind of help out my family for paying for college next year. So. Uh, and did you know of the Better Business Bureau prior to I had heard of the association through local businesses, but I wasn't super familiar with it. Oh, okay. Well, as you would have found out uh, from looking up the organization and what we do, you would have noticed that we have a large focus on ethics and leadership, community service. Um, so I wanna know what are some of your leadership traits? Um, I consider myself to be super ambitious and very motivated. I try to be influential while maintaining humility, and I'm not afraid to speak my mind, but I know when to bite my tongue too. So, yeah. Mm -hmm. I feel like I like that. That's, I feel like that's critical thinking going on at the same time. So, <laughs> I appreciate that. Absolutely. So, when you're giving back to your community, what is that feeling that you get when you're giving back? Um, it definitely gives me a rush. It warms my heart to know that I can play a small role in the lives of the people in my community, so. Oh, okay. And what would be some of your favorite forms of community service? Um, I've been on two overseas mission trips to Ecuador and Guatemala. And while those are amazing, I also specifically love to help mothers and children. And I've got to do that in my community five minutes down the road at Bartow Family Resource Center. And also in countries like Ecuador where I can just help children and mothers who are suffering or in poverty and things like that. So that's specifically some of the stuff I really love to do. Oh, that's pretty neat. Did you go on these international service trips with like a group or? Yeah, I went. It's a program at my school called Spring Term, and we travel like all across the world for two weeks and go and just help in whatever capacity we can. So, yeah. Oh, that's pretty neat. I like that idea. Um, so, of course, you know that you're a scholarship winner. Yes. I want to know when you receive this scholarship or you figure out how much it's going to be, where would that money be going to work? Um, yeah, so I'm the funds will end up going towards my undergraduate degree at the University of Georgia. So Ooh, okay. I, yeah, I decided um, last week. Um, so I'm super excited to begin my freshman year there and the scholarship will definitely help cover some of the cost. So. Oh, go dogs. Do you know what you're gonna end up majoring in? Um, well, <laughs> right now I'm an early or an English education major and I don't know. We'll see if it sticks. I don't know. God has mm -hmm. a plan for what's going to happen, but I don't know. Yes, we'll see. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> okay. Yeah. I mean, you don't have to be interested to be like, oh, I have to stick to this or anything like yeah. that. I promise you, like, college, when you're there, you're able, you have the freedom to make your own decisions. And right. Like That's that. what I'm telling you. at the same time, <laughs> it was like, yeah, I feel like definitely just speaking to you right now, you have enough common sense. You have the leadership critical thinking of course you have a good heart good moral value so right i definitely think you'd be able to find your right track yeah i'm um, excited <laughs> yeah, so one last question before we get to have you opening um your scholarship offer um do you have any recommendations for future scholarship applicants um i would say just to be completely open and honest with the organization um and definitely in the meantime be helping out and giving back to the community in whatever way you can um, scholarships from companies with big hearts like better business bureau don't come often so it's so refreshing to know that i have financial help for college so yeah i would definitely recommend just to get involved in any way you can beforehand Hopefully that was a beautiful answer thank you so much <laughs> uh, <laughs> so i feel like We've waited long enough, and I, I want to know, I know you want to know how much money have you received from the Better Business Bureau. So did you get an email from Anita? I did. I've, my, I'm about to open it, right? Or do I just go? <laughs> yeah, open it and go ahead and read that first paragraph so we can know your prize. Okay. 
please find attached the email version of your scholarship. Ooh, okay. Here we go. Oh, wow. Wow. Okay. <laughs> the recipient of this award will receive $2,500 scholarship. Congratulations. Thank you. Oh, sorry. That's my mom in the background. If you can. It's okay. It's all right, mom. I was clapping too. I'm excited as well. <laughs> Oh, great. I'm so excited. Cool. Congratulations, Anna. Thank you. Congratulations. So much. And on behalf of everybody here at the Better Business Bureau, we wish you the best and we look forward to what, to what you are doing in the future. So. Great. Thank you so much. All right. You're welcome. Thank you for applying. Anytime. <laughs> See y'all. All right. Have a nice day. Bye, Bye Mom. <laughs>